welcome back to another vlog so i decided to start a new vlog today with no idea of where this vlog is going to lead to i just really wanted to start a new vlog today because it's been a while since i um since i vlogged it's actually been a while like i haven't picked up this camera to vlog in a bit anywho um i look like this because i filmed an instagram reel earlier and i actually really 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 love this also you guys i switched up some of my um makeup products i say some but like actually i literally only switched up my um primer and my um setting spray and honestly like usually i feel like my makeup is more dewy this is giving me a matte finish i've always really loved when my makeup is dewy but i actually really really love this one I love it i'm going to show you guys the primer i switched to and my setting spray as well let me know if you're feeling this look as well by the way nail nail cam pink has never really been my color but like i'm actually feeling it like i've always hated pink like i'm just i'm just not like i'm just i just don't like the color but i really love this okay so obviously you guys know that i moved back to nigeria and i was in a serious dilemma i wouldn't call it serious because i was just in my head about it all and i was feeling so sad i know i was feeling so sad because like i was running out of my i was running out of my foundation my nyx foundation my NY. i don't know if it's, they call it nyx or nyx but like you know the one i'm talking about if you watch my makeup videos then you know that that's my foundation like that's what <clears throat> That's what I always use. So I was running out of my foundation. I was running out of primer and my <clears throat> my setting spray. I already ran out of that, and I was really telling myself like, oh my god, like I need to find like where to get my my <clears throat> wow. <clears throat> I need to find where to get my makeup in Nigeria because it will make more sense to have stuff shipped if it's like like you know bulk items, like so many items that is being shipped back to you but like if it's just few items like it wouldn't make sense i have to find like vendors that actually carry the products that i want to use or the products that i use um in nigeria um so i was really dipping in one day and this is why i say jesus is king because like he literally just he saw my worry like he knew my heart and he told me don't worry child i can't put these stones with my nails so i needed like a tweezer and i just set out to go and buy a tweezer when i got to javi lake mall i came across this store one sec she called touch of michelle's and i'm just going to show you guys the bag of Michelle's and I just walked in like casually I was just like oh like do you have um the next products or do you have the next foundation or just like yeah I was just like you have the next foundation she was like yeah and I was just like okay do you have it in this shade in cappuccino because that's the shade I use and I was really just expecting her to be like oh sorry almost she and I was and she had it like I was so like the way my heart was just like god I was just so happy and then she brought one she gave me one I was just like oh do you have like do you have any more like do you have a second one and then she found the second one I got the Urban Decay All Night Face Primer and I also got the Morphe um, Mattifying Continuous Setting Mist literally these are the only two things that have changed in my makeup routine and there's a whole ass difference because my face that's usually like super dewy is so much like it's been between five to six hours really and it's still so much like i always i have like a little bit of creasing my smile line under my eyes but that's fine like that's fine i still don't want to get botox i can't really help my guys pictures king Ah, this ring light is doing bit baby you're doing too much yeah i think it's a good angle yeah my battery is about to die god you guys i'm gonna have to come back all right bye okay you yeah, guys so i'm back after i've seen my camera charge for like 2.5 seconds but yeah i just really wanted to unbox these graduation pictures for you guys really quickly before like i take off all this makeup and call it a day I guess maybe you can have your pictures delivered to you in your home country but like I didn't do that um, I didn't think I had the option so I'm not sure but yeah like obviously your graduation pictures don't get delivered to you straight after like grad day or like you know a week after even if it was a week after it would make sense but like it will take a while 
and obviously i'm already back in nigeria so i still had it delivered to my house in the uk and my sister brought it back for me i look so cute i think <laughs> god i look so cute oh my god i look so cute i was so happy i was so happy and it shows it showed it still shows i look cute but i have so many there hi guys so um today is friday and i and chidima wanted to go have breakfast at cafe de manche i've been there like three times um but the time is currently like 2 p.m by the way because we woke up late so we're going now but anyways yeah we ended up changing our minds because i've been to cafe de manche like three times and i just really wanted to, to try something new like cafe de manche i hope i'm pronouncing this thing well i'm going to put their names on the screen um but yeah like they serve really their food is really nice and the ambience is cute as well i really just wanted to try something new that's why we decided to go to wafu way instead so that's what we're doing <laughs> I'm just going to explain the day and what happened today. I'm in my bathroom, by the way, because I'm about to just like end the day. Today is my nephew's birthday. So we stopped over at his school to get some pictures with him. That's what we did earlier, but I don't think I filmed. I don't think I. <coughs> wow. <coughs> Cough will embarrass you. I went to the bistro with my fam. I um, went to get brunch together. And if you know, if you if you lived in Abuja for a while, then you probably know to the bistro. But like now, like I think they closed down their old branch. I say branch, but yeah, they closed down the old restaurant they had shot, and like they came back. You just you know, a new location new vibe new management i think it's now being run by lebanese people i think these lebanese people hmm. anyways yeah yeah we had um brunch which was nice like i mean i wouldn't like the food wasn't like oh my god it wasn't crazy it was okay like it was it was it, to be to be honest it was quite mid it wasn't yeah but it was still okay, it was still okay. And then after that, um, I did school run. And then I actually must stopped over at Spine and Labels, which is a bookstore. And I went to get a book, Chinema wanted to like just look around. And yeah, that was what happened. I didn't end up seeing the book that I wanted to get, apparently. They were all sold out, but yeah. That's what's happening. That's what's happening. That's what's happening. You know, I just I just felt like I owed you guys an explanation. I can't just be like putting clips together. I'm like, I'm just about to like, you know, do skincare. 
I'll either show you guys. Well, it's nothing new. So I probably, I probably won't show you guys. But then what would be my point of so setting up my tripod in the bathroom right now? Might as well. Okay. 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 Guys, you're obsessed. It's just, you're obsessed. But it's just like I just need to touch grass. Like I have no social life. So guys, what, do you want me to do? <laughs> it's not an obsession. It's just that yeah, you watch a show, right? And first of all, a show like Bridget, you need two to three business days to process, right? <laughs> and I think that's important to two business. I watched it on Friday, right? Like, if you see Bridget in season two, right? Watch episode seven. You know the part after. Why would I be like, explain this thing now? How would I say? <laughs> you know, you know the part after they they did whatever they were doing, right? After the part that they stopped, she stopped being a gentleman and she stopped being a lady. Yeah, after the part where he stopped being a gentleman and then she stopped being a lady, right? And like she came back into her room and she was having flashbacks. You know the part I'm talking about. Go and watch that thing in zero point five speed. <laughs> But yeah, if that is obsessed, that is bottom line of the story. Hi.